So today I thought we would take a little trip down my Reddit. Not my subreddit, which none of you are in, by the way, and nobody posts in it anymore. Go join the subreddit, by the way, u slash Tasman595. It's actually a pretty funny place, honestly, if people would actually post there. But today, instead, I felt like going over my top posts that I've ever made on Reddit, just because I feel like some people don't even know that I have a Reddit account. My Reddit account is u slash R. I just wanted to go over my top posts and like all the different subreddits that I've ever posted in and I think it'll be pretty funny and we can like look back on it. Getting started with the first one with 13.3k upvotes it was on r slash I had a stroke and this was a conversation that I had with my friend Cole. Um, I sent a picture of Zero Suit Sam as drinking a Red Bull because we were having an argument of whether or not Monster or Red Bull was better, and clearly I'm on the right side of saying Red Bull is better. It is. Red Bull gives you wings. So I said Red Bull, and he goes, Which of the... That's gay. <laughs> Did you have a seizure? How the f*** do you get YHSYS from that? It's gay. And <laughs> I don't know, I thought it was kind of funny, so I just posted it to Reddit, and lo and behold, it got 13, almost 13 and a half thousand upvotes. It's my most upvoted post I've ever made. I don't know how this is, but like a lot of the comments, yeah, like they're proving the point. Y is next to T, S is next to A, so if we converted, they just say that's, which I mean, yeah, that makes sense. Make change, even with the best one in the world. So my next one is, um, if you've never played the game BitLife before, it's a mobile app where basically you live through somebody's life and you pick what they do and stuff. It's hard to explain. One of the things on the app is you have to buy a residence and I always forgot to do that. So my family members all have their own houses. Me who realized that I've lived with my parents for 70 years in the app. It has three and a half thousand upvotes and I always forget about the buying houses feature because Everyone does. You always end up living with your parents for a long time. I've lived with my parents while I started my alphabet challenge. I would be willing I would be willing to bet they weren't happy to have me and my husband and 13 kids there. Like it'll make a lot more sense if you played the game, but for all you people that play BitLife, you'll definitely understand this. Oh, oh the next one was something that got taken down. Uh it was removed for, like, using numbers on software gore because apparently that's not allowed, but basically this Funko Pop uh, is for ages 432 and up. So obviously it was a glitch and I just posted it to, like, a glitch subreddit and it got taken down because numbers and yeah. Butter dog. The dog with the butter. Butter dog. I got the butter on him. The dog with butter the butter. Dog. Okay, so this is a YouTuber that I still watch to this day. Um, one and a half thousand upvotes. Well worth making the meme, to be fair. Um, basically this YouTuber makes Reddit videos every Tuesday. He lives in the United Kingdom, and his name is Jack Sucks at Life. You also got Jack Sucks at Geography, Jack Sucks at Stuff, Trade Boy for 20, Jack Su Jack's Epic YouTube channel full of fun times and fun, Hyrick Kiss. I'm surprised I got that first try. Jack Massey Welsh. Sam smells of apricots. He has a bunch of YouTube channels, but that's the whole joke of his thing. And he collects YouTube play buttons, as you're like seeing by these clips on the screen right now. So he does um, Reddit videos on his Jack Sucks at Stuff channel every Tuesday. So I made a meme. It's Tuesday, so the Reddit video will come out, and it's Tuesday, which means this post will make it into the video. But actually... Anyway, top post of the week. It's Tuesday, so the Reddit video will come out. Yay! It's Tuesday, which means that this post won't make it into the video. But wait, <laughs> it did! Yeah, I made it into the Reddit video, surprisingly, and that was really cool for me. Yeah, I've also been in um this video of his, too. Can you do the lovely? Lovely. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, he left himself as well. I like that guy. He could stay. That was smart, that one. And that was a pretty fun video. I think that was the last Discord video he did, but enough fanboying about Jack. Let's get on to the next post. I walk to Burger King, then I walk back home from Burger King. So this was my first r slash memes post to hit a thousand upvotes. Um, it's just a Minecraft meme. If I'm 99% I'm sure I stole this. 
Like, I made this meme, but I think I stole the idea. If Minecraft worlds are infinite, then they're all connected. Everyone confused screaming, which I've definitely heard that somewhere before, just like a uh, Billie Eilish joke that I know that people that listen to Billie Eilish are too scared to ask the waitress for mustard packets. It's kind of the same thing with this, where I just saw it and I'm like, huh, I can make a meme out of that. And I made a meme out of it and it got a thousand upvotes. So I don't know. I guess it did pretty well. I bet I could have also put it on our Minecraft and it would have been the same, but yeah, there's that one. Nine hundred upvotes. Teachers, I don't want to see you on your phones this whole period. Also the teachers when the students are taking a test. Me? Next post. Also, this is probably a good time to mention if you're not already, you should definitely be following my Reddit because I honestly frequently post on there. I don't really scroll through Reddit, but I do post on there a lot. So if you want to see like funny memes and stuff that I post, just follow my Reddit, u slash Fazil R. And while you're at it, head over to my other social medias too. There's a link in the description that has all my social medias and you can go find it. And yeah, and you can also listen to my music too. I do. I have a cover of Zombie by the Cranberries coming out. And by the time this video is out, it should be on stores, but it might not be. I know that it's on YouTube right now on my topic channel. Okay, here come all the Filza memes. So Filza is another YouTuber that I watch. He's a hardcore Minecraft YouTuber. He's the guy that died in the five year long no! hardcore survival world. Really? If you ever heard of that, I'm, I'm playing the clip oh over the screen God. right now. But um, yeah, I've been watching him ever since that mishap and he's on season four now, I believe. And he's 60, 60 episodes in. I think he's a lot further though because he hasn't been uploading much. But yeah, this was this was a huge joke back in like the early season four episodes. A normal nice going stream, big donation, Phil crying his eyes out. It it would it would happen every single time there was a huge donation. It was really wholesome, honestly. And I decided to make a meme out of it, and I did. Shut the f up! Then another Philza meme. Uh Twitch chat on the weekends. Can you play Minecraft? Phil. No. Basically on the weekends, Phil streams Rocket League, I believe, and he actually commented on this. He said, I enjoy this meme. Oh, you playing Minecraft? I like it, Kudgy. This is something I, I literally just posted this 11 days ago. There's a band called Psychosexual where if you don't know, the former drummer of the band Five Finger Death Punch left and he formed this project called Psychosexual. Honestly, I don't mind their music because they just do it as a joke and it's fun, but they get a lot of hate for what they do. So I thought I would like, not jump on the hate wagon, but like make a meme for the psychosexual haters so I could get internet points. So I did, mom, can we have Red Skull? No, we have Red Skull at home, Red Skull at home. And of course it's Devil Daddy. What? It's Devil Daddy. What the fuck? AKA the lead singer of Psychosexual, AKA Jeremy Spencer, the drummer that left Five Finger Death Punch. It's confusing, I know. Yeah, this was the thing I linked them to, and this is just... What's up, all you sexy devil-worshipping dickheads? <sighs> I'm your devil daddy, and we are psychosexual. We're gonna do a song now that you can all touch front to. We like to call it, Let the Sin Begin. See, they're good in the studio, but live is just... It's something else. Without saying a prayer, let the let the sin begin. You'll be wiping my love that's dripping from your chin. Let yeah, they're... I, I, I'm, I'm trying to avoid a copyright claim here, but... Yeah, they are an interesting band, to say the least. And... I don't know. I just felt like making a meme about it, but I'm honestly gonna leave it there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and if you did, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe button, and also turn on the notifications, because those are pretty useful for knowing whenever I upload. I'm trying to get back into uploading a little more. It's not really working that well, because I'm getting slowly demotivated, but I'm also not. 
I don't know. It's hard to explain. But other than that, have a good day. Enjoy life. Enjoy if you're in a lockdown or something because of COVID. Enjoy that. Other than that, bye.